Uh, true story of that news. I'm going to come back with another video. There's going to be messages from your past on loved ones. Alright, the story ain't for everybody. You only take what resonates with you. Alright. Someone, ancestors, wants you to know, to, wants you to hold on. Alright, they want you to know that this battle is not yours. Right? This battle is the Lord's, okay? They want you to be strong and hold on, okay? Okay. All right, so we have someone's grandfather out here, okay? Your, grand your grandfather said this battle is not yours, okay? It's his and the Lord's, okay? It's not yours. Um, so we have the letter Y. The name could start with a Y, first or last name. Your grandfather's first or last name could have started with a Y. Okay. Someone could be dealing with an opportunist. All right, your grandfather wants you to know someone's an opportunity. All right, and you need to have emotional intelligence when you're dealing with this person. Mm -hmm. um, equal give and take, and don't intervene in the divine plan. So, someone's grandfather is telling them, "Don't intervene, don't get involved, because you, you keep." Doing what you're doing. Keep giving me, doing equal give and take. Uh, you keep having emotional intelligence, all right? I don't have to fight. He said, you don't have to fight. He will do it. Don't, you don't have to fight. All right? Don't intervene with him and God's plan, all right? This battle is not yours. It's the one. And he, your grandfather is glad that God seen this, all right? Everything you do, God sees. Every thought you have, he's here. He hears, okay? She said it belongs to the Lord. It's bad it was not yours, baby, okay? So we're going to use the messages of closure, all right? The videos are going to be short, guys. Um, again, your grandfather says, come on. Passed on. Their father, grandfather passed on. Name, your name could be Wild. Um, first or middle, first middle or last initial. That could be your grandfather's first or middle or last initial. All right. Okay, spirit. What are the messages? I watch you with your family. All right. So your grandfather watches you with your family. All right. What are the, um, any more messages for, you? for this person? Any more messages from their past and loved ones? Mm -hmm. Okay. Any more messages for you? Okay. All right. This says, do you want me around? All right. Do you want me around? Your grandfather wants to know, do you want them around? Or maybe this is how they felt before he passed over. Or they feel like you didn't want them around. Any more messages for you? Or maybe you are, if you... If you see a light blinking on and off, it could be your grandfather. Right. I don't know if this is scaring you and he wants you, he's asking, do you want me around? Okay. I know you have trouble trusting. All right. So if your grandfather he know you have trust issues. But he needs you to use emotional intelligence. What else, for?
I didn't know how to comfort you. So someone's grandfather didn't know how to comfort you. He wants you to know you will get through this, okay? Spirit said, that's confirmation. Yes, that's the truth. I hope that you can forgive me. The grandfather hope that you can forgive them one day. They don't want you to intervene in the divine plan. Something about an opportunist that could be around you. Um, the grandfather. He wants you to have equal, equal give and take. Um, but he definitely wants you to know that you will get through these so far. Some final messages, closing out messages. Today. It says divine creation. Uh, the number twelve could be significant to someone. You could be born in the month of December. Uh, your birthday could be the number twelve or the date. Uh, so this card talks about acceptance, personal commitments. And euphoria. Right. Maybe you have a problem committing to someone, one person. Right. Name could start with a Y, or your, grandparent, your grandfather's name could have started with a Y. Okay. We have Cosmic Gateway. All right. And number eight could be significant. All right. So it says insecurities, connection with others, refocusing. All right, so you need to refocus, and you need to try to um, connect with others. All right, and be be uh, wary of this this opportunist around. Right. Any more messages from this person's grandfather? If this is resonating with you, talk to your grandfather. He can hear you. Right. Yeah, he said pray. You need to pray. Pray, call on God. Ask God to help you with this situation. Decision, ego based actions, lifestyle change. All right, so your, your passed on loved one says you expect a lifestyle change, or you need to have some type of lifestyle change. Stop being indecisive, stop going off your ego, all right, and don't have ego based actions, okay. Right. If the past on loved one could have had a beard, red beard, or you could have a red beard, yeah. no cut. Yeah. You need to meditate, you need to pray, All right. and, and tell your grandfather what you need from them. All right. they, they can't come and help you unless you ask for them. I don't know who this is going to resonate with. Again, it's about your grandfather. Your past on loved one. Your name could be starting with a Y, first, middle, or last initial. Your grandfather's could have been starting with a Y, first, middle, or last initial. Okay. I don't know why I want to end it. I'm going to end it. Let me see. Any messages from this deck for this person? From their personal level? Okay. I 
think it wanted to fit. Okay. Alright, so someone needs to work on their third eye chakra. Alright. Your grandfather's trying to communicate with you. Okay. Anything else for it? So I feel like this is coming from this opportunist who says, I wish I never met you. All right, so you, you're you around someone and you think they're opportunists, they're around and they're in this for something other than wanting to love you and honor you. Um, they wish they never met you. And that's the one that's asking, do you want me around this opportunist, okay? Your grandfather said they a snitch. All right, this opportunist. All right. Anything else? So someone's grandfather wants them to go get a checkup. All right. Because someone can't be trusted. This opportunist. Okay. And if he says meditate longer. All right, so I said someone needs to meditate. Um, but you're meditating, but you need to meditate a little longer, your grandfather said. And so go start a new job. Okay. And ask the universe for help. Remember I said you gonna see what can he do for you? You know what I'm saying? Like talk to him, talk to God, ask him for help. He'll help you. You need clarity in something that help you. You need help getting a new job? Talk to them. Okay. Meditate longer there. They will communicate with you. You just have to quiet the mind, meditate, and listen. Okay. Again, if someone's grandfather communicates with messages, it's passed on loved one. Right. First, middle, last name, initials, whatever the Y. Yours or. Grandfather. I have you guys. I wish you nothing but the best. Don't forget to ask, talk, pray to God, ask God for help. Ask your grandfather and his angels surrounding him, him and you to come in and give you clarity. All right. Ask them to help you open your third eye chakra. All right. But most importantly, go get a checker. Something about this opportunity. All right. God bless.